Hey, Andy here from buildahottub.com. In this video, we're going to look at the different types of plumbing connections that exist when we're building our DIY hot tubs. Okay, so we've uh, looked previously in some of the other videos of the, the different pipe that's involved. So we know in general that a two inch pipe is used for water. We know that a one and a half inch pipe is used uh, for air. And we know that on the front of the gunite body, and we know that on the front of the gunite bodies, we have a two and a half inch pipe. And then we also have the uh, one inch pipe that goes inside as well. So they're the different kind of sizes of pipe that are involved. Now, if you're looking at a, uh, a stock tank build or a wood build, uh, you won't be using this kind of a gunite. You'll be using the smaller kind that will take a one inch pipe for both the air and the water. So that's, that's just for the wooden builds and the, uh, the stock tanks as well. So when we're looking at the, uh, the different connections that we, uh, that we need, uh, there's, there's lots of different terminology that might be a little confusing. So what we're gonna try and do is just straighten that out in, uh, in this video. So the first and probably the most common type of connection is a socket connection. So what a socket connection allows, so I've got a 90 degree, I've got a two inch 90 degree bend here that has two socket connections. And that allows for two inch pipe, to fit inside of that connection. So a socket connection, the pipe actually goes inside the, to the, the connector to make the joint. Socket connectors, again, can be found on, on, on other items. So I've got a gate valve here. This has a socket front and back. So again, that pipe just pushes in and, uh, and makes the connection inside of the, the, the plumbing part. The next type of connector that we're gonna look at is called an, an SPG or a spigot connection. Now these are slightly different uh, as you can see here. So um, I've got my, my socket connection and I've got my pipe here and I've actually got an end cap that is a, a spigot connection. Now a spigot connection will not fit over or into pipe. As you can see, it's exactly the same width. So this is a two inch spigot connection or an SPG, and that's exactly the same width as the two inch piece of pipe. So what that means is spigot connections are designed to go inside of other plumbing fittings. So my 90 degree here, two inch fitting will take the spigot end cap. So spigot connections, they, they don't go inside or over pipe. They're exactly the same diameter as the pipe itself, and they go inside of other fittings. Whilst we're looking at end caps, I've got a, another two inch end cap here. So this is a socket connection end cap. So again, slightly different from the spigot that we've just looked at. So that will fit over the top and the pipe fits inside because that's a socket connection. So I just wanted to show the, the two different types there. Now you can actually mix and match the, the connections. So what I have here is a, I've got a 90 degree two inch bend but I've got a socket connection on one side. So with the socket connection, we can put the pipe inside, okay, regular socket. On the other end, I've actually got a spigot connection. So this is a, a socket one side, a spigot the other, so that will go inside of a, uh, another plumbing fitting, as you can see here. And lastly, there's the kind of threaded connections, and you may see uh, two different acronyms. You may see MBT and FBT. MBT stands for male buttress thread. So it's a type of threaded connection. These are the kind of things that you'll find on pump unions or filter unions, where you've actually got to, to twist the, um, the connector to, to kind of screw it onto uh, the fitting. So MBT stands for male buttress thread, a bit of a mouthful to say, and FBT stands for female buttress thread. So they're both threaded connections, uh, so don't get those mixed up with your SPGs, your spigots, or your socket connections. If you've liked this video, please do like, share, and subscribe to the channel. See you on the next video.